हेलो एवरी वन माई नेम इज अमोल मोरे एंड वेलकम टू अवर चैनल सोल्यूशन टू ब्लैक बुक नाउ टूडे वन ऑफ अवर स्टूडेंट्स हैज आस्ट दिस वेरी नाइस क्वेश्चन वॉट इज द डोमेन ऑफ साइन इनवर्स ऑफ सेकेक्स वेर सेकेक्स इज इंट्रोड्यूस्ड इन साइड अ जी आई एफ ब्रैकेट दैट मीन्स इट इज अ ग्रेटेस्ट इंटीजर फंक्शन ऑफ सेकेक्स नाउ डोमेन मीन्स वी नीड टू कैलकुलेट द परमिशिबल वैल्यूज ऑफ एक्स Now we all know that whenever we have sine inverse of x, then x can be between minus one to one inclusive of both. But instead of x, they have given us g i f of sec x. Therefore, g i f of sec x should lie between minus one to one. But naturally, g i f is a greatest integer function. So you can see that. g i f of sec x can be minus one, zero, or one. There are only three values possible for g i f of sec x. Now let us look at one by one at all the possibilities. So first of all, g i f of sec x equal to minus one. When is it possible? When sec x is lying between minus one and zero, it can be equal to minus one, but it cannot be equal to Zero, but we know one thing for sure that sec x is actually having the range which is from minus infinity to minus one union to one to infinity. It means sec x can take values from one to infinity and from minus one towards negative infinity. so over here if you look at this problem sec x can only be equal to minus 1 nothing else nothing else is possible because sec x cannot be having any value between 0 to minus 1 it will always be above minus 1 okay now let us move ahead sec x equal to 0 for g i f bracket so sec x can be equal to 0 but it will be always lesser than 1 but this totally does not lie in the range of sec x that's why this particular thing has to be rejected very well then we have one more thing where sec x g i f should be equal to 1 so for this sec x has to be equal to 1 or lesser than 2 okay now this totally lies in the range of sec x so let us calculate this sec x 1 to 2 Now let us apply sec inverse on all sides. So after applying sec inverse, you should be sure that inequality sign flips or not. Now sec inverse is an increasing function because the derivative of sec inverse is positive. Hence there will be no particular change in the inequalities. because derivative of sec inverse x is 1 upon x under root 1 minus x square so for positive values of x it will be increasing and for negative values of x it will be decreasing so basically what we can say is that for positive values of x you can say that it is lying between sec inverse 1 to sec inverse 2 now this is when x is greater than 0 okay this is when x is greater than 0 now sec inverse 1 is nothing but 0 and sec inverse 2 is nothing but pi by 3 okay now for negative you have to just look at it this way for negative the derivative will be 1 upon x under root x square minus 1 but our x is all you can say negative so you can say that x lies between minus pi by 3 to 0 where 0 is 
inclusive and minus pi by 3 cannot be inclusive therefore as you can see minus pi by 3 to pi by 3 is the possible domain of this function okay or else you can directly see that in the first quadrant or in the fourth quadrant both quadrants sec is positive the other simpler solution can be this that sec is actually positive in the first and the fourth quadrant so in the first quadrant it will go from 0 to pi by 3 and in the fourth quadrant it will go from minus pi by 3 to 0 so basically x goes from minus pi by 3 to pi by 3 very well then domain can simply be written as by adding 2n pi on both sides so 2n pi minus pi by 3 and 2n pi plus pi by 3 will be the domain non-inclusive of the end points so the domain for this function is this particular part now let me show you the same with a graphical example so over here i have drawn the graph of sine inverse of gif of sec x as you can see in between values are not there so let me show you see 0 is there and this last value let me show you the last value you can see 1.04 now pi by 3 is actually 1.04 and see this minus 1.04 that is actually minus pi by 3 and this will repeat after 2 pi interval see it is repeating after 2 pi interval after you add 2 pi you will see pi 5.24 is the answer which is minus 5 pi by 3 so as you can see the domain of sine inverse of gif of sec x is actually which is shown over here 2n pi minus pi by 3 to 2n pi plus pi by 3 and that is how you will get the domain for this particular question thank you for watching the video guys and do not forget to like share and comment on this channel's videos and do not forget to subscribe